Welcome back to Trends and Friends. It's Tuesday, and that means we're celebrating our Casey Carpet One Teacher of the Week. And this week, we are celebrating Jennifer Smith of Anton High School. Yes, Congratulations well, to you. you. Thank you so much for being here, bringing yes, your beautiful daughter with you yes, to cheer you thank on. You. So tell us, what grade do you teach, and how many years have you been teaching? Um, I, have, I teach at Anton High School. I teach ninth through 12th grade English, and I've been teaching nine years now. Nine years. Yes, so all at Anton, or have no, you been ma other places? Other places around. Lubbock. Yes, okay. All right. Yes. Always go find my way back to Anton. Is that home? Yes. Well, yeah. home teaching. Yes. Absolutely. <laughs> so what got you into teaching and what has kept you there? Um, I have a degree in English and so I really enjoyed um, sharing my love of literature with other people and so sharing that with students just seemed to be a natural fit. Absolutely. So. And what keeps you there? The kids. Absolutely mm -hmm. my kids. They are wonderful and they have wonderful hearts and there's not a lot that's better than watching them walk across the mm. stage at graduation. Yep, and as a parent, I would agree with you, yes, right? Yes. So, always high school? Always high school. Always high school. A little school. bit of middle school here and there, mm -hmm. but always, mm -hmm. always high school is where my heart is. Absolutely. Sure. So, I'm sure COVID uh, rocked your world a little bit. Uh, Tell us a little bit about that transition and um, coming out of it. And yes, we're, we're coming forward. out of it, and so we're we have a little bit of a transition, as you say. But um, it, you know, getting kids to interact a little bit more with people and screens has been a little bit interesting. But it's working out great. Absolutely. And uh, give us your teaching philosophy or a motto that you teach by or that you make sure to share with your students as they are, especially because you have high school, so they are. They're venturing out yes, to the next season. Ab about to be adults. Yes, <laughs> so We yes. talk about adulting a lot. Um, but no, we, I, I think you have to reach your kids um, on, the, on the level of their heart first and foremost. Um, if they respect you, they will be more open to teaching and mm -hmm. listening and learning. So um, that's probably one of our biggest things is teaching to, to their heart first and foremost. Absolutely. Well, that is very yes, nice. I love that. And uh, you have children? Yes, ma'am. I have a daughter, mm -hmm. 14 years old, Sydney. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you her teacher? <laughs> no. Good Lord, no. I think we both agree, no. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Well, thank you. And we yes. are just want to say congratulations to you. We're, we're thankful that you're here. And, um, and you must have, did you know that you had been awarded this before you got the phone call? No. That you were the teacher? No. The okay. No. So it was a surprise and it was really nice. And I appreciate you letting <laughs> me bring my daughter so that she can celebrate the, the teacher part. Absolutely. Mom, so thank you. Well, you are a blessing to all of those kiddos. They might not know it yet, yeah. <laughs> but you are for sure. Also joining us is Shelby. Yes. And so Shelby, if you want to present the yeah. award. Award to Jennifer and yes. here's this for you. you. Congratulations. We truly appreciate Thank everything you that much. you do. So just keep up the good work and Great. yeah. Thank Enjoy you. your gift card. Absolutely. So um, from those of us here at Trends and Friends, we have a gift card to Nukes Eatery. So it's dinner and drinks for two. So we want to give that Great. to you so you can Thank you. Uh, pamper yourself and whoever else you want to take with you and um, so we just again thank you so much congratulations to you thank you Shelby for being here and before we go we want to remind you to start thinking about those awesome teachers out there uh, to be a part of our teacher of the week so send us your nomination for those standout teachers in your community and don't go anywhere we'll be right back with more trends and friends <laughs>